What's going on guys? It's Tim Plays here and today we're back with another Minecraft video and in this video we're starting a new series and our goal is to beat Minecraft. We're going to be destroying the Ender Dragon and maybe continue this series if we make it that far but yeah so we're going to be playing on this black and white world. Everything is black and everything is grayed out so there's nothing of color except me. I am the only skin of cake that is barfing rainbow for myself as you can tell and yeah so we're gonna start off this game and check out what we can do to start off the game we gotta get some wood let's try this map out i was kind of inspired by this one minecraft youtuber who made a challenge where it was everything was one color and one texture only so everything was black or everything was gray and you couldn't tell what block was what and he finished the entire game just playing off of color so yeah let's try this out hopefully we can beat this minecraft map without any color so first we gotta get some wood that's the first step to any survival world hopefully we finish this map someday someday in the future it's our goal that's gonna be a series if you guys want more please leave a like down below and i will definitely continue the series first we gotta get a pickaxe so we can get some stone hopefully we even know what stone looks like in the game i think i can kind of see what block is what but it's not entirely clear i think everything's gonna be so dark down there because everything is just gray first step get some coal get some stone we gotta make some torches so we can stay in the underground area i'm probably gonna finish a house by the end of this episode so hope you guys stick around and hopefully my house is pretty good there's no face cam for the series i'm not sure if i will add a face cam if you guys want one just comment down below you guys want a face cam for this series and i will definitely do it okay stone is already gray so it just stays gray this is dirt and dirt is also gray now as you can tell let's hop down here and hopefully find something good i'm gonna catch up with you guys after i finish mining a bunch down here and we'll start our house in a bit after i start chopping down some trees okay guys i just finished mining this little cave system down there and i gotta say it's not the best cave system that i've ever found and it's already nighttime, so we gotta somehow make a tiny little bunker underground so let's kill some sheep so maybe we could get a bed but yeah in that mine system there was barely anything i didn't get any iron i think i got a total of 13 iron and i got tons of coal though i have 59 coal ores already and that's actually really awesome we gotta kill this creeper so it doesn't kill us everything's great even the mobs are great so we gotta be careful of them we just need one more piece of wool so we can get a bed so hopefully we can kill this without having to deal with anyone else let's go back down into the mine system right here nope there's just there's just water we can't even tell what the mine system even looks like anymore okay it's pretty nice and right outside all right so we got to block ourselves off somewhere maybe this hole this was a coal hole that we digged out and that's it's gonna be our house for a bit we gotta make a bed we got some wood and we got some wool it's gonna be hard organizing our inventory because everything looks the same and yeah so i got 13 iron ore and 59 coal but that's all let's make a furnace so we could make some uh, mutton cook mutton right here let's cook it up right there and we should cook up our iron for later let's place down our bed hopefully we can sleep yep nice we can sleep so it's gonna be daytime and we can start making some houses outside so we gotta get some wood and then we can make a nice cozy house for us to stay in we got our cooked mutton we can eat that and now all we're waiting for is the iron right here and then we can make ourselves a nice iron axe and we could go farm farm some trees up top and we could go and build ourselves a nice house i don't even think color of wood even matters anymore i'm pretty sure all the wood looks the same all the woods kind of look the same actually there's a little bit of a shade difference but they're all gray so it wouldn't be that hard to mix and match these wood blocks because they would basically look the same so let's get this iron makes ourselves a nice little 
iron axe for us to go up top and farm some trees i hear some skeletons above us so that's a little scary we killed the creeper before we jump down here so we're fine we should be able to hold them off while we're down here let's make a little pathway up or just memorize this route up so we can find our iron when we come back out Okay, there's two, there's three llamas. Do llamas give me food? Let's try it out. I'm not sure if llamas give me food, but hopefully they do or else I feel bad. Okay, they don't give me anything. I'm sorry, llama. I didn't mean it. We're gonna have to deal with these creepers. Even these creepers don't stand out like they normally do. Those creepers don't stand out at all. Alright, I think we hit the jackpot, guys. There's so much wood over here. There's a lot of oak wood. I like to use oak wood because it's really easy to make houses out of them, but let's try it out. Maybe we should try a mix and match between birch and oak. Who knows? Because the colors won't be that different. We, sh we should try it out. Alright, let's get more oak, and I'll catch up with you guys after I get a good amount of oak wood. Alright guys, I got a good amount of wood. I just collected our furnace and our crafting bench down here. And we got a total of 10 iron ingots that we've been smelting down here. And I also killed a few pigs so we could have some food when we need it. But yeah, I got a good amount of wood. We can make some house right here. It's a nice little clear area and it's our spawn area. So it works out perfectly. We should probably cook some of our pig meat down here. Or some pork right here. And we could get a good amount of food that we can eat. Let's place down our bed just in case. I don't even know if it's nighttime anymore, guys. It's nighttime or daytime. Doesn't matter. It seems the same to me right now. Let's eat an apple because that's all the food we have right now. And let's start our house right here. Maybe we should make it facing this way or this way. I'm thinking about this way. All right, let's start off the house with a nice little opening. I'm gonna make. I'm probably gonna make a little patio right here. So. Let's make a small little dimension area for our patio. So it's like right there. And I'm guessing the house is going to go out to like right here. Is that a big house? I think that's a pretty big house. Let's make it a little smaller. I don't think we need a house that ginormous, guys. Let's finish the planning and I'll see what I can get done. Let's make this patio three wide like that. And then the doorway will be like right over here. And we could make it go out like over to here. How about that? That seems about all right. So we can make this go up a little. And make this go up a little as well. And let's start off with our building. So we got to get our oak planks. Place, place some slabs. I think I'm going to make slabs because it saves us some wood because i don't have too much wood i only got a stack of wood so we can make some oak wood slabs and use that as our floor if you guys don't know slabs take up less wood so we could just place it like that and it'll look pretty decent because if you look at it from the side people will see it like that and it'll look pretty nice so we can make a staircase up to it so get our wood make a staircase up to our little patio like right here there we go and let's place a wood up there so it looks a little neater and it looks pretty good so far i think i think we're on the right path to making a nice house right here we can make this go up even more just like that and the floor will go extend out just like that with some wood slabs because it saves us a lot of wood so let's make let's make a good amount of wood slabs because we're gonna have a pretty big floor so how about 64 or that's only 36 come on tim you can do the math right i don't know we'll just get some <laughs> we'll just get some wood and we'll get our way over there we can't even make 64 i need more food as well guys i need more food all right let's spread this out a little bit more and get some of our wood blocks to put on the side just like this and our house is coming to not along nicely guys our house is coming along nicely and hopefully it looks pretty decent i'm not sure yet because i haven't seen the finished product how big should we make the house i think i'm gonna make it go out to here's 
but maybe we could expand in the future but for now i think this house is gonna be like this so place it right there and finish the border off so we can use the slabs in the center and we might make this a two-story house it looks kind of like a one-story house right now maybe we can make it two in the future but we're gonna have to expand on this house if we want to do that so make the edges like this i think this is kind of squared but it looks decent for now we can change it up in the future but for now it looks pretty nice i don't mind it i don't mind it at all but yeah guys what do you guys think about this series is it a little confusing for you guys because everything is black and white or do you guys enjoy this series just leave a like and tell me in the comments down below that you guys love this series and i will do more of this series because i don't have any survival series on my channel lately so maybe i can make this one of the survival series and hopefully we can beat the game using this series let's make these borders like that is it gonna be a three-story house well it's gonna be three stories for now we're gonna leave the roof open up because i'm really bad at roofs to be honest we don't have enough wood for this house but this is gonna be our house for now we can make some doors so let's go back over there and put door like that and get ourselves an oak door right here and place it right in the middle just like that and we could get some wood we don't even have wood to finish our house oh my gosh guys it looks pretty nice right now we're gonna have to go farm up some more wood and i'll be right back guys i will be right back okay guys i'm just trying to farm some wood and skeletons are already t attacking me i didn't even know it was nighttime because it looked gray like this all the time anyway so i'm not sure what i'm supposed to do there's already mobs surrounding me the skeletons are coming up the zombies are coming up what do you guys think what can i do i'm fighting for my life out here hopefully this is enough we can kill the zombie as well and there we go we're safe for now but we gotta get more wood and go back to our house and probably sleep or else we're gonna die out here there's another skeleton all right i need to get this tree and then we're we're dipping guys we're leaving this place i'm not sure if i can stay here any longer it's so dark outside and there's mobs everywhere all right oh, that's a baby zombie i didn't even see it guys i didn't even see it because it was so dark it's already dark when it's normal nighttime oh that's a that's a creeper i'm stuck in water i'm stuck in water i gotta break out before the skeleton gets on me get out tim get out oh. <laughs> the creeper got stuck in a different hole we're fine now oh shoot guys this is actually crazy i didn't expect this minecraft world to be as hard as i it has been so far because i can't see a single thing in this game because everything is absolutely great except this whole it's got that llama over there that llama is shining bright in the nighttime let's go to sleep in our bed and uh, let's get started on our house once again i didn't get too much wood because it was really dark outside and i didn't even notice look it doesn't even seem that different it's just a little bit brighter but because everything is gray everything just looks the same but let's get some more oak planks oh we gotta kill this guy before he gets us and let's make ourselves some more oak planks just like this and finish off the walls we're gonna have to finish off the walls i think we're gonna have some windows so let's make some outlines for our windows but we gotta make these out like this so it's not too dangerous for us to even stay in our house because currently it's wide open and monsters can just walk right in and say hi to me whenever they want to and i'm not very fond of that i don't like how they can just walk in let's get more wood and place it right there just like that and i'm thinking about making a two block window but i don't know where that will look good in but let's make these sides just like this all right i gotta place my blocks correctly tim Got to place my blocks correctly. Now let's break this block. And I'm thinking about making this back window a big window in the back. Just like this. What do you guys think? How does that look? How does that look? This is going to be my house to start off with. It's not very good looking right now. Because everything is great. I can't even make it look decent. <laughs> let's make some fences so the porch or patio looks decent. Is it a patio or is it a porch? 
It might be a porch. I might be saying this completely wrong. But hopefully I'm not. Let's go and check out fences. How do I make fences? I thought I was doing it right. Oh, I need oak blocks. So we gotta make some oak blocks right here. Let's collect that back. Make some oak blocks and make some fences. I think we're gonna need six. Don't want to use up all our wood already. Let's place that there and that there. And that should look decent. That should be fine. How about like that? Oh, I guess we do need that third fence right here. And let's place these right up there just like this what do you guys think i think this porch looks decent actually i don't think we we're gonna need these fences that just makes it look a little weird but there we go it should be fine now and why don't we extend this porch out just like over here like that place these down like that just like that that looks a lot nicer let's place these fences right here and perfect i think this porch looks decent too and do I have extra stairs? I have one extra stair. We could place it like right here. Make it a little sitting area right there. And looking at the view sitting in this seat right here. Look at the view. It looks nice, right? Except everything's gray so you can't see much. But I think it looks pretty good. I think I'm going to end off this episode right now. It was pretty fun playing on this world. If you guys want more just like this one, leave a like down below. Can we hit, uh, let's see, can we hit 100 likes by the end of this week? And I will definitely do more videos just like this one. And I hope you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new. Turn on post notifications so you guys know when I'm uploading another video just like this one. And yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, boys. Peace.